Und runter geht's. Ähm. Ach nein. Line number one. The serious incident in the Arcadia Central Station was me running for my life. Hills is a severely unstable individual and may represent a threat not only to himself, but to every other citizen of or visitor to Arcadia. Line number two. I'm not severely unstable. Or, or at least I wasn't unstable at that time. And look at me, for God's sake. Who could I possibly represent a threat to? If you see this individual, please immediately report him to local authorities. We wouldn't resort to these extreme measures if it weren't absolutely necessary. But our priority is to ensure the well-being and safety of everyone in Arcadia. <laughs> and that makes three lies in a row. She couldn't care less about our safety. That was exactly the reason why I was running. Vivian has declared that she made that statement to, and I quote, ensure Mr. Hill's physical well-being. Oh, of course. She described me as if I were the next Jack the Ripper to ensure my physical well-being. Give me a break. I'm Arcadia's public enemy number one. What do I do now? Ren. Make sure you're not seen. Damn, it's the Beastie Boys again. They've sent the interceptors to get that one picked up. Ach, das klappt einfach warten. Damn, it's the Beastie Boys again. What did I do to that horrible woman? She hates my guts. I told you, evil bitch suited her better. Hexagon? Right there. It's Trevor Hills. Send the drone. Oh. Natürlich eine Drohne. Hexagon, any news about Hills? Yeah. Hey, hey! Hexagon, elevator has stopped. Reset now. Right there. It's Trevor Hills. Send the drone. Na. Oh. Ich hab den Mist doch angehalten. Any news about Hills? Yes, we got all exits covered. He's not getting out of the mall. We'll play the warning on the PA system soon. Ich kann nur runter. Na, wenn ich ihn runterlass, habe ich ein Problem. Runter. Right there. It's Trevor Hills. Send the drone. Oh. Da war ja hinter uns einer verabtisch. machen kommen wir wieder zurück weil der geht ja eigentlich auch noch in die richtung ach wir können also auch wieder runter Bob, ist das was
Wir können also nicht zurück. Kann es sein, dass ich, wenn ich die Drohne kommt, die Drohne abschalten muss? Ist nur so ein Verdacht. Einmal nicht. Nee, nur runterlassen. Moment, ich weiß, was ich machen kann. Ich war doof. Die sehen ja da nichts. Zeit für was Neues, würde ich mal sagen. Zeit zum Umziehen. Hauptsache, er fällt nicht so auf. Anschalten oder abschalten? Ich habe keine Ahnung, was sinnvoll ist. Wunderschöne gute Nacht. Okay, den konnten wir abschalten, aber wir sehen nicht mehr. Verdammt. Das interessiert die gar nicht.
Wie interessiert der das nicht? Ah, jetzt sehe ich das Ding. Aha. Sie sind halt Profis. Wir hacken hier alles, was möglich ist, und kommen hier auch noch durch damit. This is the Swift Car Pickup Area. Look at the charge status screen. We need a full battery to get to the edge of the dome. Looks like the one in the top right seems to be the only one with a full battery. Good. Then take that one and let's get the hell out of here. Ist klar, ich nehme natürlich den voll aufgeladenen. Ganz oben, mhm. Mm It's not a red car, Angela. It's a Sunlight Chrome Rush 166M. The most perfect work of engineering ever designed. And my favorite car. I don't know, man. All cars look alike to me. Uh, stay there while I bring your perfect work of engineering to you. Um... Moment. And oh. Was ist das überhaupt? Wahrscheinlich nach oben. Das bringt mir nichts, also... Nein. Da passt der andere nicht hin. Ich bräuchte, ich weiß, Moment. Klappt das nicht, wie ich gerne hätte? Das ist nervig. Ich muss den hier rauskriegen. Weil da habe ich keinen, keinen Platz dafür. ich das Auto jetzt dahin, wo ich das gern hätte. Ich kann den Kleinen zwar nach oben bringen, aber es bringt mir das gar nichts. Und der Rote ist halt so groß.
Ah. Nein. Angela, didn't you say this car didn't have enough battery to reach the dome? I know. I know, I know, I know, but I need to Let me handle this, okay? Ach, das ist, ist nein, ich muss hoch. Und jetzt kommen wir nach oben. Oh, der kommt hoch. Nein. Der muss nach unten. Der muss nach unten. Er kommt hier rein. So. Na. Und rein da. Jetzt kriegen wir... Nein! Nein! Geht doch. So. Na! So, hier mein Sportwagen. Oh my, look at this sweet ride. Shining aerodynamic lines, a masterpiece of craftsmanship that combines... I hate to interrupt your beautiful love story with an inanimate object, but we'd better get a move on. Sheesh, fine. Let's get go. Uh, Angela? Yes? Can you tell me a little about that dome you mentioned earlier? Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Live from the Arcadia Dome, I'm your host, Vivian Walton, and this is American Arcadia. Whew, oh my, oh my, looks like a storm is gathering. And no, I'm not talking about the three-day blizzard that the weathermen have predicted. Here in Arcadia, we're safe from all of that inside our precious weather-controlling dome. Thanks for that, Grandpa Elijah. What I'm talking about is something that some of you Tiffanyers might already know. If you were one of the 2.6 million viewers who yesterday watched the passionate stolen kiss between supermodel Tiffany Amber Gaines and, oh boy, Steve Just's best friend, Logan Krakowski. I guess that explains the argument they had last Sunday during the Adams game, huh? My Nasty Remark of the Week award goes to user AppleSphinx91, who posted, No wonder why Tiffany broke up with him. There's only one person Steve Just could actually fall in love with, and that is himself. Woohoo, that burns. The polls are on fire. 34% believe Tiffany had every reason to give Steve the boot. But look at this, 58% and rising are in favor of the Tiffany Logan romance. Log in to your AA Live app now and let us know your thoughts. But we can't forget our loyal justifiers who are supporting their idol Steve Just and think that Tiffany and Logan's relationship is simply going nowhere. We have it. Hey, How's the car battery? Good, good. Still full. This is going smooth as silk. At this pace, we'll reach the dome exit in no time. Let's hope so. Mind if I tune to a little music? Not at all. And you're listening to WABC Hits, Arcadian Station with the finest music around the clock. This is DJ Zoom with the cream of the crop, only Stella, out of sight, number one hits, baby. And the music just keeps coming in this hot Friday afternoon. Ah, <sighs> much better. Next is my girl, Meryl Jefferson, with her groovy hit, Don't Be a Fool. Oh, come on, Angela. What? I had nothing to do with it this time, I swear. God, what have I done to deserve this torture? The song is everywhere. Enough already. 
Everybody loves Merle, man. Don't be a fool as a hit. Inside and outside are... Shit, oh. shit, shit, shit! What? I can see five interceptor cars, and they're heading straight to the Arcadia Dome. Wait, you think they're coming after me? It's very likely. Uh, I have to think of something. It. Ay, bendito, now what? Ich komm ja schon, ich komm ja schon. Was will sie denn hier? Yes? Hello, Angela, it's Kendra. Can I come up? Um, I'm a little tied up right now, Kendra. I... Don't worry, it won't be long. I'm coming up. Ay, pero que quiera ahora? What's happening, Angela? <sighs> Kendra's coming up to my apartment and there's like a ton of incriminating material in here. Hey, who's Kendra? My stupid boss. She's coming up. What do I do? Get rid of any compromising material, Angela. I'll help you think from here. Yeah. What about my escape plan? Do you have it written down somewhere visible? You talked about that group you work for. The breakout? Is there something in your house that would link you to them? Yeah, ich komm ja gleich. Can't you just cover it all up somehow? My, my Zimmer is in the Ausspiel. Info about Gus and all that? You don't have that lying around your house, do you? Angela, open the door. Yeah, yeah, ich mach ja schon. Ja, ja, ich mache hier schon. Hey, Kendra, how did you get in here? Well, all supervisors have access to their employees' apartments, just in case. Why didn't you open the door? I thought something happened to you. Uh, I was going to, but you were faster. Do you mind if I take a look around? Around my apartment? Yeah, it'll just be a second. Uh, okay, I guess. Suit yourself. Shit, I can't do anything else. She's gonna see me. What's the meaning of all this? Any forbidden corporate things? Like, I don't know, anti-Arcadia propaganda? Wait, you showed me things. Info about Gus and all that? You don't have that lying around your house, do you? Eh. Angela, doesn't a computer always Angela. take an attorney to shut down? I'd do that first if I were you. Yeah, yeah, it's so good. I can hear you in there, Angela. Yeah, it's so good. Angela, open the door. Open it now. Yeah, yeah, it's my here. Opening door. Hey, Kendra, Shit, I can't do anything how else. did you get in here? She's gonna see me. Well, all supervisors have access to their employees' apartments, just in case. Why didn't you open the door? I thought something happened to you. Shit, oh, I can't it's gonna take me forever. Uh, She's gonna I see was sticky notes, but can't you just Shit, were faster. Do you mind if me. I take a look around? Around my apartment? Yeah, it'll just be a second. Uh, okay, I guess. Suit yourself. Hey, what's that in the window? <laughs> Leaving all the evidence in plain sight. <laughs> Clever. You're fired. You talked about that group you work for. The breakout? Is there something in your house that would link you to them? Any forbidden corporate 
things like, I don't know, anti-Arcadia propaganda? Angela? Oh, it's gonna take me forever to get rid of these sticky notes. Can't you just cover it all up somehow? Angela, doesn't a computer always take an eternity to shut down? I'd do that first if I were you. Angela! I can hear you in there, Angela. Yeah, yeah, I do it. Well, all supervisors have access to their employees' apartments, just in case. Why didn't you open the door? I thought something happened to you. Uh, I was going to, but you were faster. Do you mind if I take a look around? Around my apartment? Yeah, it'll just be a second. Uh, okay, I guess. Suit yourself. What's the meaning of all this? Uh, what's then? What about my escape plan? Do you have it written down somewhere visible? These breakout pamphlets won't look good if Kendra finds them. Wait, you showed me things. Info about Gus and all that? You don't have that lying around your house, do you? Yeah, yeah, I have that from Vic. I'd do that first if I were you. Oh, it's gonna take me forever to get rid of these sticky notes. Angela. Can't you just cover it all up somehow? Ich mach ja schon. I can hear you in there, Angela. Angela, open the door. I can hear you in there, Angela. Open it now. Door lock override. Opening door. Hey, Kendra, how'd you get in here? Well, all supervisors have access to their employees' apartments, just in case. Why didn't you open the door? I thought something happened to you. Uh, I was going to, but you were faster. Do you mind if I take a look around? Around my apartment? Yeah, it'll just be a second. Uh, okay, I guess. Suit yourself. Shit, I can't do anything else. She's gonna see me. What's the meaning of all this? Has it done that already? Any forbidden corporate things like I don't know. That's no problem. Do you have it written down somewhere visible? Uh, that's no problem. Wait, you showed me things. Info about Gus and all that? Angela. You don't have that lying around your house, do you? Angela? I can hear you in there, Angela. Yeah, du darfst mich ja auch hören. Open it now. Door lock override. Opening door. Hey, Kendra, how'd you get in here? Shit, I can't do anything well, else. Well, all supervisors have access to their employees' apartments, just in case. Why didn't you open the door? I thought something happened to you. Uh, Shit, I, can't do anything I was else. going to, She's but see me. you were faster. Do you mind if I take a look around? Around my apartment? Yeah, it'll just be a second. Uh, okay, I guess. Suit yourself. Hey, what's that in the window? Uh, 
it. Leaving all the evidence in plain sight. Clever. You're fired. Ja, ich weiß, ich bin gefeuert. Any forbidden corporate things He's like I don't know, anti-Arcadia propaganda? Wait, you showed me things. Info about Gus and all that? You don't have that lying around your house, do you? Angela, doesn't a computer Angela. always take an eternity to shut down? I'd do that first if I were you. Oh, it's gonna take me forever to get rid of these sticky notes. Can't you just cover it all up somehow? Don't. I can hear you in there, Angela. Angela, open the door. Uh, that's no problem. Open it now. Uh, Dora, that's override. no problem. Opening door. Hey, Kendra, uh, that's no problem. you get in here? Well, all supervisors have access to their employees' apartments, just in case. Why didn't you open the door? I thought something happened to you. Uh, I was going to, but you were faster. Do you mind if I take a look around? Around my apartment? Yeah, it'll just be a second. Uh, okay, I guess. Suit yourself. Won't look good in Kendra's eyes. Well, your apartment isn't as cluttered as your office. It still has your personal touch for chaos, though. Thank you, I think. Uh, that's, uh, that's no problem. Uh, nervous, that's no problem. Angela. Uh, Is everything okay? That's no problem. Uh, no, apart from my supervisor breaking into my apartment, uh, everything's hunky-dory. Uh, I yeah, nervous. This board has been erased recently. Oh, yeah, that's why they're called dry erase boards. Because you can, you know, erase them? Hmm. Okay. Are you worried? You don't have anything to hide, do you? Oh, I'm a little paranoid, Kendra. Well, I would certainly hope so. Your blinds are lowered. Yeah, sunset light bothers me. Nothing unusual here. Oh, look what we have here. None other than Trevor Hills himself. Hook. What about my escape plan? Do you have it written down somewhere visible? These breakout pamphlets won't look good if Kendra finds them. Angela, doesn't a computer always take an eternity to shut down? I'd do that first if I were you. Angela? Wait, you showed me things. Info about Gus and all that? You don't have that lying around your house, do you? Ein Scheiß. Angela. Oh, ein Mist. I can hear you in there, Angela. Angela, open the door. Open it now. Door lock override. Opening door. Hey, Kendra, how'd you get in here? Well, all supervisors have access to their employees' apartments, just in case. Uh, Why uh, that's didn't no, you uh, open the door? Uh, that's no problem. I thought something happened to you. Uh, I was going to, but you were faster. Uh, uh, that's no problem. Do you mind no if I uh, take a look around? Uh, that's no problem. Around my apartment? Yeah, it'll just be a second. 
Uh, okay, I guess. Suit yourself. Uh, that's no problem. Ja, wenn sie es hat, das well, kommt your apartment isn't as cluttered as your office. It still has your personal touch for chaos, though. Thank you. Immer wieder gern. You look nervous, Angela. Is everything okay? Uh, no, apart from my supervisor breaking into my apartment, uh, everything's hunky dory. Ja, halt nicht ordentlich bei uns. erased recently. Oh, yeah, that's why they're called dry erase boards. Because you can, you know, erase them? Hmm. Okay. Are you worried? You don't have anything to hide, I do know. you? Oh, aren't we a little paranoid, Kendra? Well, I would certainly hope so. Your blinds are lowered. Yeah, sunset light bothers me. Nothing unusual here. Is there anything wrong with your computer? Why is it off? We're in lockdown. Why do you want me to turn the computer on to beat my Minesweeper high score? <laughs> I knew it. I knew it was you, you traitorous bitch. Eh? Any forbidden corporate things like, I don't know, anti-Arcadia propaganda? Angela, doesn't a computer always take an eternity to shut down? I'd do that first if I were you. Ein Scheiß. Angela? Any forbidden corporate things like, I don't know, anti-Arcadia propaganda? I can hear you in there, Angela. Um. I can hear you in there, Angela. Open it now. Door lock override. Opening door. Hey, Kendra, how'd you get in here? Well, all supervisors have access to their employees' apartments, just in case. Why didn't you open the door? I thought something happened to you. Uh, I was going to, but you were faster. Do you mind if I take a look around? Around my apartment? Yeah, it'll just be a second. Uh, okay, I guess. Suit yourself. Raus. Ihr findet doch eh wieder was. Was meine die... Uh, well, yeah, that's your no apartment problem. isn't as cluttered as your office. It still has your personal touch for chaos, though. Ja, ich weiß. Thank you. Danke. I think. You look nervous, Angela. Is everything okay? Yeah. Uh, no, apart from my supervisor breaking into my apartment, uh, everything's hunky dory. This board has been erased recently. Oh, yeah, that's why they're called dry erase boards. Because you can, you know, erase them? Hmm. Okay. Are you worried? You don't have anything to hide, do you? Oh, no. Aren't we a little paranoid, Kendra? Well, I would certainly hope so. Your blinds are lowered. Yeah, sunset light bothers me. Nothing unusual here. Is 
Is there anything wrong with your computer? Why is it off? We're in lockdown. Why do you want me to turn the computer on to beat my Minesweeper high score? Hmm. Angela, please come Kendra, here. What is this all about? Let's lay our cards on the table. We're friends, right? Um, we are? If you were doing anything to harm Walton Media's reputation, I would be deemed directly responsible, and you wouldn't want that. So tell me, how is it possible that you had admin permissions today? Oh, I did? Uh, that's news to me. Uh, maybe poor Gene got it wrong. He's been under so much stress lately. But you could check the surveillance cameras if you doubt me. I didn't even go near the server room today. Huh. I have one more question, Angela. Answer it and be honest. Are you the one helping Trevor Hills escape Arcadia? No, I am not. Definitiv nicht. Have a nice evening, Kendra. Yes. Fuera de mi casa. Sounds like everything went sort of okay, huh? <laughs> sort of. I owe you one, man. Wait, you owe me? Come on, Angela. No, really. Thank you, Trevor. You're a good guy. Okay, well, I am going back to my computer now. Wunderschöne gute Nacht. Wer fast schief gegangen. Es wäre sowas von schief gegangen fast. Ähm. How's uh how's everything going on your side? Good, good. I think I'm reaching the suburb area. When you see the Adam Arena Stadium on your left, drive past it and take the next exit to the suburbs. Hey, Angela, I was wondering, how is it possible for the Arcadia Adams to play against teams from the outside? Oh, all players are NPCs, non-protagonist characters. People who live inside Arcadia but are part of the show, uh, like Vivian. Next topic, connection with Arcadia-born citizens. Now, you've been given some plot points by the story team, but engagement is critical in here, specifically with the ones in your assigned network. Ordinary lives are not interesting by themselves. We gotta make sure that things happen. That's good for the audience, for your assigned citizens, and in the end, for you too. That's what you, what we are in here for. To be their shitty bosses, their rivals, or BFFs. It all depends. And who knows, maybe even their yeah, spouses. Much for <laughs> it's not common, but it has happened. I mean, I consider myself as the first NPC in Arcadia. Well, not actually the first one. I'm not that old. <laughs> but the thing is, the story team would never ask you to do anything that I wouldn't do myself. So if you ever wondered why everything goes well for the absolute jerks, egomaniacs, and obnoxious people in the city, now you know why. Well, that explains some things. I bet that Romano, my supervisor, is one of those. Could be. I don't know. I only have access to my assigned citizen grid. But, you know, George Bernstein, your neighbor? He was in cahoots with the show from day one. Not Mr. Bernstein. I've known him since I was a kid. Yeah. I, I must have the full list of NPCs somewhere, so if you want, I can send it over. No, no, no. There's no need, really. You revealed quite enough of Arcadia's intricate lies for me today. Hey, Angela, I'm beginning to hear that noise again. It's still distant, but... All right, all right, uh, keep driving until you can't drive anymore. This is horrible. It's hard to describe how it sounds. I can't, you have to, you have to do it. I'll take control now, Trevor. Don't worry. Look at that. Those things that look like comm towers. I think I saw some at the checkpoint too. Yeah, you're definitely right. 
definitely right. Must be transmitters or something. It's even louder than it was at the checkpoint. I can hear it even if I cover my ears. Trevor, we, uh... Okay, now we have to cross that area. Do not touch the steering wheel or the brakes, please. As if I could. It's hard for me to even blink. Oh, damn it! Oh, God! It's tearing my brain apart! Hold on! Hold on just a little uh, longer, ouch. Trevor! Like, I had the biggest damn magnet inside my head, and someone was pulling on it. But I'm better. I, I feel better. You think you could drive now? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Good. Ooh. Okay, let's get the hell out of here once and for all. Hey, go ahead. Don't say it, don't say it, Angela, last time you jinxed it. Yeesh, okay. But you're out of the transmitter zone, so what could go wrong now? I've been involved in high-speed pursuit for years. I'm not scared of it. I study the road layout, carefully cover all the exits, register everything in a 10-mile radius, and calculate every possibility. I can't afford myself to fail. Not while I'm on duty. Dann tritt auch seinen Dienst aus. Yeah, there's a lot you didn't see. Doesn't mean it didn't happen. See these wounds? Let's say I was lucky to survive a crash at 95 miles per hour. And that was only the first car crash of the weekend. Uh, uh, ow! Oh, Jesus! Ah. Uh, Angela! Where am I? Angela? Angela! Are you there? I can't hear... Oh, damn it, I lost my earpiece. I have to... I have to get out of here. Move, Trevor. Come on, move! Das hat was von dem Anfang. really close to the dome exit. I have to get out. Sir, target is not in the car. I repeat, target is not in the car. Der tut mir halt jetzt so langsam richtig. Ich dich. 